This past week, the oldest server in Minecraft was griefed. And I'm not talking about 2B2T, the oldest anarchy server in Minecraft. Oh no, I'm talking about Minecraft Online, which is technically the oldest server in the history of the game. Normally, griefing is against the rules in order to protect all of the historic buildings at spawn, but for 24 hours this past week, grief protection was turned off, and it was total anarchy. I had the opportunity to log into the server during the chaos and see Minecraft's oldest server fall into ruins. It's funny how once rules are removed from an otherwise civilized server, how quickly everything goes horribly wrong. Today's video is definitely going to get a little crazy, and if you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, make sure to do so. No time to waste. Let's do this. I had to launch the game in version 1.4. I haven't played on this version since 2012. So this is going to be a very interesting experience today. For 24 hours only, I guess 2B2T is not the oldest anarchy server in Minecraft. Minecraft Online is. All right, here we go. Logging in, and it's already destroyed. <laughs> that was quick. Look at all these lava casts and the old lava texture from the old version of Minecraft. That's funny. And holding bedrock, just coming straight through lava, just flying around. Yeah, no one's hacking. It's totally legit, guys. No one's hacking right now. So this place has already devolved into chaos. So we got to find a way out of here, but it... Even though we're unarmed, they're leaving us alone. They're not trying to kill us, so at least the people here are a little friendlier. Uh, hey, uh, you, you know, you hate to see it. You hate to see someone burn to death in the first 20 seconds of the video. But now, how do I get out of here is the question. This is a maze at this point. Here we go. Finally, some freedom. So we are now on the surface of the oldest server in Minecraft. Because Minecraft Online is technically a little bit older than 2B2T, but it's <laughs> it certainly looks a lot like 2B2T. Look at this. Buildings are all destroyed. The spawn area is getting wiped out by hackers and griefers. Uh, well, what server am I actually on right now? Sheesh. It's just, this is like the apocalypse. But hey, I'm having fun at least. My first order of business is to find food and resources, because without them, I'm just a sitting duck walking around like this. There's got to be some resources around here. I mean, all these builds were already complete before they got griefed, you know? Man, I can't drag the blocks when I'm trying to craft. I forgot you couldn't do that in the old version of Minecraft. Oh, <laughs> this sucks, man. <laughs> What does it say? Notch? <laughs> I think Notch actually did join this server once a long time ago, but oh, <laughs> and there's already a wither. Great. And I'm not hacking right now. I'm in complete vanilla mode. I mean, a 2012 hack client is not something you just keep lying around, <laughs> you know? So this is a real challenge right now. There's no food around. At least I have some seeds now. But look, even the roads are destroyed. All the infrastructure is slowly withering away. Like, an actual anarchy server. I know, you know, grief protection being turned off was like an April Fool's joke, but still, it's funny how all servers without rules become 2B2T eventually. It's kind of funny. Now, are there any arrows in here? Look, look at this. What's crazy is that this build here was supposed to be a set of ruins, but now it actually seems like apocalyptic ruins. That's crazy. But I don't think there's much down here. Uh, yep, just as I thought, there's nothing here. Uh, well, at least we tried, you know. Maybe we'll have our better luck somewhere else. Now, may oh, oh no, 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 not, no, not these sniper skeletons. No, 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 no. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. This is not gonna. Uh, I was afraid of that. And back to spawn. Yeah, great. Oh, but oh, they're at least building a bedrock tunnel. Well, at least. At least the people on Minecraft Online are a lot nicer to newbies than the people on 2B2T are. So at least we got that going on for us for now. Oh, he just got booted, man. Booted straight through that tunnel. But it looks like we keep our items on death, so that definitely helps. I think, yep, there's a house up there. That's very good for us. Uh-oh. Oh, that's a lot of withers. Things are about to get very interesting. Oh boy. Uh, pumpkins, and it uh, doesn't look like much else. 
But hey, a pumpkin is a pumpkin. I'll take it, you know? Maybe we can make some pumpkin pie later. Much like I did on 2B2T back in the day, I'm trying to survive with zombie flesh right now. That's my only option for food, and it seems to be pretty plentiful. So I'm not complaining. At least I have something to munch on right now. Now, we need to get some actual resources going on here. Found a little house here, but there's not a whole lot going on. I crafted a fishing rod, which should hopefully get me some better food choices. Hopefully. Mushrooms. I'll take mushrooms. You know, mushroom stew is pretty nutritious, so I can't complain too much. But now that we have a decent amount of food, we need to get actual tools. Those spawners. I don't know what they used to be inside, but whatever was there is not there anymore. And this menger sponge, uh... Well, it's got a few more holes in it than I think it's supposed to have, as you can clearly see. Man, the griefers really did a number on that thing. And this is just a small section of the server. The entire thing is getting wrecked. Completely. Oh, look at that upside-down pyramid up there. Someone tore a hole through it. Oh my god, look at that. That's insane. Now, maybe there's some resources right over... I knew, you know, I had a feeling there'd be some sort of, like, beacon resource blocks, and sure enough, there's iron and there's diamonds, so we need to get down there, steal them, and use them for ourselves. Now, uh, I'm gonna have to take some fall damage. Ow. Ugh, better than that. Oh, would you look at that? Well, I guess we're truly good on food for a while, even if it's not the best food. But hey, you know, I'm starving here, so I'm not gonna complain about all this rotten flesh. That is pretty nice. Now, let's see. I don't believe the wooden pickaxe is going to be able to harvest these resource blocks, but I can just make a stone pick real quick, and we can go to town. There we go, get some iron, and then I can turn the iron into a tool to get the diamond, because, yep, as you can see, I can't get it right now. There we go, this progression's going quick. Now that I'm getting some diamond blocks here, I can actually gear myself up and actually stand a fighting chance at spawn. Even though I'm not hacking, at least I stand a little bit of a chance. Go. Oh, it's beautiful. So now that we're geared up and we've got food, it's time to go back to spawn. Now, I'm a vanilla player going up against hackers, so this is kind of the reverse of what it normally is on 2B. Oh boy. And it's even more destroyed than it was just 30 minutes ago. Look at this. And it looks like they're still building stuff here at spawn, but man, it is just chaotic. It's so funny, it looks just like old school 2B2T right now. Not an anarchy server without explosions, people. Just remember that. But it looks like they, they built an end portal right here, too. They, have, they don't even care. Uh, and I don't think that's gonna work. I applaud the effort, though. I just gotta say, I'm having so much fun right now. This is so nostalgic. This is just how anarchy servers were back in 2012. So it's, it's a blast from the past. Alright, let's get in the end here. Let's see what's going on. And it is just as destroyed as the overworld. And and there's a wither over there. Great, so we need to get past that thing somehow. We'll just waltz by it. What's the worst that could happen, FitFam? Let's go for it. Yep, don't mind me. I was just uh I was just leaving. So I'm just gonna mind my own business. Don't mind me, Mr. Wither. Uh, uh and I just looked at an enderman. Not good, not good, not good. Let's go, 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 go. Oh, uh, uh, there we go. Whew. Safety. And here's the portal, and it is misaligned. Great, they pulled a pop bob. They placed it in the wrong orientation. So, maybe there's a different portal around somewhere. I guess we have to look for it, but, like, this place is so destroyed. Where do we even look first? We might as well go up, I guess. It's, uh, I hope you're not afraid of heights if you're watching right now, but uh, even if we die, we won't lose our items, which is good. Alright, maybe up here there's something. And nothing. Great. Just great. Just great. I think I've got no choice. I'm gonna have to commit Sudoku here, because there's no other way for me to get out of the end. You know? I just realized that every death I've had on Minecraft Online today has been from the environment, not from other players, so this is really becoming an anarchy server, isn't it? Overall, I gotta say, having the oldest server in Minecraft become the oldest anarchy server in Minecraft for just a day has been a wild experience. Going back to the 2012 versions of Minecraft to experience all this has been wild. 
But luckily, it's gonna go back to normal, and it'll just be the oldest server in Minecraft. And us degenerates can stay on 2v2t. But anyway, if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to subscribe and like the video. Also, make sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram to stay updated on when new Minecraft content is coming out. And thank you again for continuing to support the channel. That's it for today, everyone. Take it easy, and we'll see you next time.